In this video, I'm gonna show you nitric oxide breathing. So now what you need to do is you need to sit down or lie down for this. And the reason why is because nitric oxide breathing is no joke. You may get dizzy, you may get faint from doing it. I just got to my office, I'm in here. What I'm gonna do first is I'm sitting down, I'm gonna have my feet on the ground, nice and relaxed, my back is up against the, the back of the chair, and I'm just gonna relax and get ready. So, here's how you do it. And also, I'm gonna have a bonus at the end, so make sure and watch through this, but at the end, I'm gonna give you an extra bonus. It's important to understand that nitric oxide is made in all cells, but for the most part, it's the nasal cavity, as well as the inner lining of our arteries. And when nitric oxide is released into these cavities, the number one, it dilates your blood vessels or relaxes your blood vessels, thus decreasing your blood pressure. The second thing is it makes the platelets less sticky, so less likely to clot. So let's get started. So how you do this is you're gonna breathe in as deep as humanly possible through your nose and then let the air out. Breathe in through the nose, let the air out. So I'm gonna just do it and you can go ahead and follow along with me. Now some people will say to breathe through the belly, some people say the lungs, some people say both. It really doesn't matter. So just do what feels most comfortable to you. And also you can experiment. I like to get a, as deep a breath in as I possibly can as if I'm gonna jump into a cold, freezing pool of water. Man, I feel good. I feel much more relaxed. Little dizzy, little uh, feeling faint, but you could feel tingly in your arms and your legs, and it just feels good. If you check your blood pressure before and after, you'll find that your blood pressure goes down. If you want to see specifics about the breathing technique, more than I'm showing you right now, and where I take my blood pressure before and after this breathing method, then I'm gonna put a link right down there. If you want to learn, and this is the bonus, this is very important because breathing does have an effect, but for long-term benefit, you wanna do this every single day at least once, and then alter your diet. Eat foods that actually create more nitric oxide into your body, and I'm gonna put a link right there. And that's just for you, and that's a bonus for you. So, if you like these videos, thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification, and I'll see you next time.